To follow shocking new developments in a double homicide investigation, a man is now behind bars for the murders of a Northwest Atlanta couple. And as CBS 46's Ashley Thompson explains, that man accused is her son. Keith Sylvester is now sitting in the Fulton County Jail, accused of killing his own parents. Police say 65-year-old Deborah Hubbard and her 67-year-old husband Harry were strangled to death in their home on Harville Drive in July. They were found after their house went up in flames. Harriet Bowens lives next door and found out about Sylvester's arrest this morning. My orchid man told me that uh, he saw it on the news and I was like, keep. Bowen says she'd see Sylvester from time to time when he would visit his mother Deborah and stepfather Harry. She says he was unemotional the day they were found dead. He was calm when he came up that night and saw all of the flames and all that stuff. The Hubbard's home here on Harville Drive remains boarded up as police continue to investigate a motive for the murders. The Hubbards were retired and had just moved to Atlanta from New York last year. On Monday, their son waived his first appearance at the Fulton County Jail. Bowen says his strange behavior after the murders is now making sense. And he called several times to talk with me. The one time, the first time he called, he, he said he just wanted to come and just talk. I didn't bite, you know, because I just, you know, I didn't know what was going on, so I had nothing to talk about anyway. Sylvester is being charged with two counts of murder. In Atlanta, Ashley Thompson, CBS 46 News.